Hey guys, welcome to Calm Facts. It can glow in the dark, is neither a plant nor an animal, and is capable of causing fatalities. No, not aliens. We are speaking about mushrooms, those peculiar and delectable delicacies that may be found growing in the thick of the forest. However, the more you discover about fungi, the more they begin to seem like extraterrestrial beings taken from the pages of a science fiction book. You'll come away with a newfound understanding of the strange and wonderful world of fungi after reading this list of the strangest and most compelling facts about mushrooms. If you are new here, just click on the subscribe button and press the bell icon to get instant notification of the latest videos. Number 10. A mushroom is the largest organism on Earth. A mushroom is a type of fungus that is found in many different environments around the world. Some species of mushrooms are quite small, while others can grow quite large. The largest organism on Earth is a mushroom known as Armillaria ostoyae, which covers an area of over 2,200 acres in Oregon's Blue Mountains. The organism is estimated to be between 2,400 and 8,700 years old, and it is thought to be a single interconnected organism. The fungus is able to spread underground through its network of mycelia, which can cover vast areas. It is a fascinating organism that is still not fully understood by scientists. Number 9. Mushrooms can absorb oil spills. Mushrooms have been found to have the ability to absorb and break down oil spills. Certain species of mushrooms, such as Pleurotus ostriatus and Pleotus syringi, have been shown to be effective in absorbing and degrading oil. This is due to the presence of enzymes in the mushroom's mycelium, which are able to break down the hydrocarbons in oil. This process can be used to clean up oil spills in both marine and terrestrial environments. In addition to absorbing oil, mushrooms can also be used to remediate other pollutants, such as heavy metals and pesticides. This makes them a valuable tool in the fight against environmental pollution. Number 8. Mushrooms can relive depression. Mushrooms have been used for medical purposes for centuries, and recent research has suggested that they may have antidepressant properties. Psilocybin, a compound found in certain species of mushrooms, has been found to have a similar effect on the brain as certain antidepressant medications. It has been shown to increase neuroplasticity, which can lead to an improvement in symptoms of depression. Some studies have also shown that consuming psilocybin can lead to an improvement in mood, decreased anxiety, and increased feelings of well-being. However, it should be noted that consuming mushrooms for medical purposes should be done under the guidance of a healthcare professional as they can have potentially serious side effects and interact with other medications. Number 7. Mushrooms are neither plants nor animals. Mushrooms are a type of fungus and are considered to be a separate kingdom of life, distinct from plants and animals. Fungi are unique organisms that possess characteristics of both plants and animals, but are distinct enough to be placed in a separate category. They have cell walls made of chitin, similar to the exoskeletons of arthropods, and they obtain their food through absorption like animals. However, they also reproduce via spores like plants. They play important roles in the ecosystem, breaking down dead organic matter, forming symbiotic relationships with plants and other organisms, and producing a wide range of medical compounds. Understanding their unique characteristics is important in the fields of ecology, medicine, and agriculture. Number 6. Mushrooms are a source of vitamin D. Mushrooms are a source of vitamin D, a nutrient essential for maintaining healthy bones and teeth, and regulating the immune system. Like humans and animals, mushrooms can produce vitamin D when exposed to UV light. Some mushrooms, such as Agaricus bisporus, can produce significant amounts of vitamin D2, also known as ergocalciferol, when exposed to UVB light. This makes them one of the few plant-based sources of vitamin D. Consuming mushrooms that have been exposed to UV light can increase the vitamin D content significantly. However, it is important to note that the amount of vitamin D in mushrooms can vary depending on the species and the conditions under which they were grown. It's recommended to consult with a healthcare professional before using mushrooms as a sole source of vitamin D. Number 5. Mushrooms can glow in the dark. Many mushrooms are bioluminescent and glow in the dark. This phenomenon is caused by the presence of a compound called luciferin, which emits light when it reacts with oxygen. Bioluminescent mushrooms are found in many different parts of the world and can produce a range of colors, including green, 
blue and yellow. The mushroom species Mycenae chlorophos is one of the most well-known bioluminescent mushrooms. It produces a bright green light. The bioluminescence in mushrooms is thought to serve several purposes, such as attracting insects for reproduction, deterring predators, or even helping the mushroom to find a suitable place to grow. It's a fascinating phenomenon that is still not fully understood by scientists. Number 4. Mushrooms were first cultivated in France. Mushrooms have been consumed for thousands of years, but the first recorded cultivation of mushrooms dates back to the 17th century in France. French farmers started to cultivate Agaricus bosporus, also known as the white button mushroom, in caves and cellars. This is considered to be the first controlled cultivation of mushrooms. The cultivation process was later improved by the French and, by the end of the 19th century, the cultivation of mushrooms had spread throughout Europe and the United States. Nowadays, mushrooms are grown in many countries around the world and are a major agricultural crop. The cultivation of mushrooms has also evolved with new techniques and technologies, allowing for the growth of a wide variety of mushroom species, each with its unique nutritional and medicinal properties. Number 3. Allow trees to talk to each other. Mushrooms play a vital role in the communication and survival of trees and plants. They form a symbiotic relationship called mycorrhiza, in which the fungus, mushrooms, grow on the roots of the tree and provide them with essential nutrients. In return, the tree provides the fungus with carbohydrates. This relationship is not only beneficial for the tree, but also for the entire forest. Scientists have discovered that trees can communicate with each other through underground networks of mycelium, the vegetative part of a fungus. This network allows the trees to share resources and information. It's been found that when a tree is under attack by pests or disease, it sends warning signals through the network to its neighbors, which then produce chemicals to protect themselves. This is called the Wood Wide Web, and it's one of the most fascinating discoveries of recent times. I hope you'll get exciting and valuable information from this video. You guys are all truly amazing, and I appreciate every last one of you watching. I mean that, and I hope that you have a beautiful rest of your day. Do subscribe to the channel, like the video, and share your thoughts and questions in the comment section. And as always, I will see you again very soon.